I really encourage people all over the country, especially in specific states that are impacted by the, the violence, gun violence, crime, uh, drugs, um, um, unemployment, you know, financial. I, I really encourage those states to not focus too much on the presidential election. Now, if you're going to go vote, go vote. Definitely participate. But narrow your focus back down to the community you live in right now. If you live in a community with a population of about 10,000 people, 30,000 people, 100,000 people, 500,000 people, focus on hyper-local voting because the senators, the state reps, the, the mayors, you know, the city council, the board of education, those are the ones that's gonna impact our communities. And we are also going to feel the impact. Vote, vote, vote on your local elections and just take it more serious than the presidential election and then go out and vote for the presidential election. But what I'm saying is don't go, don't get so confused where all we are really worried about is President Trump or President Biden on the high level yeah we see that but when it comes down to our schools getting funded when it comes down to our our, our our economic development being built when the government is giving grants to build parks and, and recreational centers and technology centers and, and 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 helping to improve the communities that we live in and and when it comes to gun violence and crime and and drug addiction and programs and when it comes to those small things right there then things trickle down right here from our local elections our state senators our our, our mayors our governors um our reps Focus on hyper-local voting, please, around the country, around the world. Focus on hyper-local voting so we can really make an impact and move those out of the seats that don't belong and place those in the seats that belong. And let's hold them accountable for the next year, the next two, three, four, five years to come so we can start to see small changes throughout our communities and we can make sure that our kids that's growing up is going to be living in a better place than they are today because right now it's crazy.